Hi guys, uh, this is an update on the Swabby uh, tubeless setup. So I have water tested this. I'm not leaking out of the uh, the bead. I'm not leaking out of the valve stem. But all these little wet spots you see are the green stop leak. Uh, attempting to stop up the little pinholes. But this is a factory defect. Um, all this, this is pinholes all of this uh, there's a bigger one right there there's one right there you can see it leaking these are slightly bubbling but yeah this is this is factory defect these are great tires they roll good very puncture resistant but if you're putting tires out like this this is just not acceptable you know you, you put a tire on uh, and the uh, the bead is sealing and the valve stem is sealing and the tire the rim is sealing you shouldn't have air you should be losing air right out the side of your uh, your sidewalls like this um, I do love these tires they're they, they are a, a good brand uh, but I don't know why um, it's got past their quality inspection. Maybe, uh, maybe they they don't ride these tires and never tested them or something. That would be my guess. Um, but yeah, you shouldn't send tires out like this. So if you're listening, Swabby, this this is a major fail. Um, also, the uh, the bead is too big on these. I had to put an enormous amount of tape up on the inside of the rim in order to get these to catch air. So. They should definitely uh, work with their engineering department and fix that because they they make good tires. Uh, however, this is you know this is now this is not a good tire because it continues to leak air. I spent maybe five or six hours uh, inflating it after it deflated, spinning it. Uh, I've took it for a couple rides now uh, to see if that would uh, help push some of the sealant and block up the holes. And it's slowly kind of sealing, but it's still leaking out air. Um, but yeah, brand new tire like this, it should leak zero air like that. It's not acceptable, Swabby.